The creation of a fragrance begins in nature. Natural oils are extracted from fruits, seeds, herbs, and spices. You've heard of them. Orange, lemon, nutmeg, rose, jasmine, and vanilla. These naturally occurring oils form the first of three types of ingredients that make fragrances. But extraction takes a lot of work. So scientists figured out that each oil is constructed using three basic elements, carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen, arranged in different ways. So they can make exact replicas of any natural oil. These nature identical compounds are the second type of ingredient in fragrances. The third type is also invented in a lab using other combinations of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. These are man-made molecules. Before ingredients are used for a fragrance, they're checked for safety. Every ingredient is broken into parts, and each part checked against existing information on it. If nothing bad turns up, it can be used in a fragrance. Everything else is prohibited or restricted. There is a large palette of ingredients from which fragrances are made. Who makes fragrances? We think of them as artists because it's an art to create something unique. Uh. And just because something is safe doesn't mean it smells good. It takes years of experience to make a fragrance. So fragrance artists are secretive about their special mixtures. They don't want to get ripped off. Huh? A unique fragrance takes time and money. So it's exciting when a new one appears. Some fragrances can change lives. Items from nature, carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. That's what makes a fragrance. It's as simple as that. <laughs>